Y, alive now from Murgatroyd City. The Les Tomac Show with host Les Tomac and special guest tonight, Senator Quentin Murgatroyd City. Viewers, listeners, people in the audience, we are quite honored tonight to have the esteemed, distinguished Senator Quint as our guest. I want to welcome you, Senator Quint. Senator, I have a few questions. Uh, as you know, um, there's been a fourth victim now, and it is fairly certain that this is a serial killer. I understand that you have uh, appointed Lieutenant Skitters to head up the uh, Murgatroyd investigation team into this, but we can now definitely declare is, in fact, a serial killer now that there have been four victims. Tell us a little about well, that. First of all, Les Tomac. I want yo tell you what a pleasure it is to be here on your show and thank you for having me as a guest. Now, to answer your question, we have indeed determined that is the same perpetrator and all four victims and the forensic people have confirmed this. We have not yet identified the perpetrator but this is in fact a serial killer we have on our hands. All four victims had certain common characteristics they were all single attractive young women between the ages of 22 and 40. Yes, we did indeed appoint a very esteemed, experienced detective as the head of the new serial killer investigative team, a Lieutenant Skitters whom I have known personally for a number of years. Senator, I understand that uh, in the wake of the mass class action lawsuit nationwide from women whose faces were were injured by the Vincini face cream that you have, in fact, uh, started up a Senate hearing. That there's going to be a nationally televised Senate hearing into the Vincini Cosmetics schedule. Could you tell us a little about that, uh, Senator Quinn? Well, yes, Les, that is also correct. I will be the chairman of the Senate hearing looking into the Vincini Cosmetics scandal. The sheer number of women thousands in fact who were impacted by this thing warrants a full-scale Senate investigation and we intend to do just that. CRZY News Bulletin Alert. This is a CRZY News Alert. The body of a young woman was discovered about two hours ago in an alley behind the Murgatroyd Arts Theatre. Lieutenant Skitters, the detective appointed to head the newly formed Serial Killer Task Force, is withholding the release of the identity of the victim pending notification of family members. Lieutenant Skitters confirmed, however, that the young woman was in her twenties and was single and that this was almost certainly another victim of the Murgatroyd Serial Killer. This will be the fifth known victim of the Murgatroyd Serial Killer. Stay tuned for further updates as they become available.